the data here, people living for four years with no evidence of recurrence, and when they take out the esophagus, there's no evidence that there was a cancer there to begin with because we were able to directly inject a chemotherapeutic agent, a biological chemotherapeutic agent, right into the tumor and then activate that, that biological agent with radiation. That's, that's really kind of gee whiz, whiz bang science and technology. It's, it's really exciting. Because um, right now, when you have that T3N1 cancer, it's through the wall of the esophagus, the lymph nodes outside are involved. If you have, right now you treat those people with chemotherapy and radiation, okay? And then you let them cool down for six weeks, you bring them back, you scan them again and make sure nothing has spread. And if nothing has spread, then you take their esophagus out. When you're looking at that esophagus <coughs> in, the, in the pathology room and you're slicing it up and you're looking, if you cannot find any cell in the rest of the esophagus or in those lymph nodes, they have a 27% chance of living five years. So the fact that these guys report a 48-month survival is really, it looks really tasty.